Hello and welcome to Indian News. Here is a special news for you. The government of Prime Minister Modi recognized the importance of energy security for rural women early on as a key driver for improving their health and help them to devote productive time for nurturing their families. For this objective, the government of India launched the first edition of Ujwala scheme to benefit millions of rural households which are economically disadvantaged. Both the first and second edition of this scheme have been truly transformational in terms of its impact on rural livelihood, health, education, and outcome. Both the first and second edition of the scheme have been truly transformational in terms of its impact on rural livelihoods, <laughs> health, educational outcomes, hygiene, quality of life, and the environmental benefits it has delivered. The speed at which this program was implemented was staggering and is one of the most admired programs globally, with many countries keen and emulgating it. The successful implementation of these programs is attributed to the active involvement of Central Minister Sri Piyush Goyal, Minister for Commerce and Industry and Sri Hardeep Singh Puri, Minister of Petroleum and Natural Gas, who are ensuring the successful execution of the various government schemes so that the benefits are reaped by the intended beneficiaries. However, expansion of access to LPG on such a large scale brought new challenges in terms of educating rural customers on the safe uses of LPG. This is where PESO, India's premier safety organization, has played a decisive role in driving the initiative for rural customers' education on safety in LPG handling. However, expansion of access to LPG on such large scales brought new challenges in terms of educating rural customers on the safe uses of LPG. This is where PESO, India's premier safety organization, has played a decisive role in driving the initiative for rural customers' education on safety in LPG handling. Under the dynamic leadership of Sri P. Kumar, Chief Controller of Explosive, many initiatives have been taken in this regard. One of which is the unique LPG Panchayat program. This program, organized in collaboration with OMCs, involves a series of high-quality workshops involving all stakeholders to make sure that the outcomes are sustained. These workshops are conducted across the length and breadth of the country to ensure that the benefit of this program reaches every nook and corner of the rural countryside, including the tribal areas. Sripi Kumar, while delivering the keynote address on the occasion of the one such LPG Panchayat team, Suraksha Se Samriddhi, organized by India Oil Corporation at Pandona in Chindwada district of rural Madhya Pradesh, stressed the need for continual engagement on imparting safety knowledge in general and while using LPG in particular. The inaugural event was well attended by over 100 beneficiaries from the tribal communities of Chindwada district. Senior officials from the oil companies and the LPG distributor, who are the key link between the oil companies and their customers, exhorted the oil companies to ensure that such noble initiatives are taken to the remotes of villages for which they would have the full support of which entire organization and thank them wholeheartedly for organizing the program. Shriki P. Kumar has been an ardent supporter of Go Green initiative to help realize the ambitious climate-related policy pledge of the Government of India, recognizing the key role green hydrogen is likely to play in India energy mix as well the country's ambition to become one of the largest global players in the green hydrogen space. PESO has worked closely with the OMCs to grant them permission to manufacture, store, transport and dispense this extremely sensitive fuel by ensuring adherence to strict safety requirements con conforming to international standards. It would be worth recalling that Sri P. Kumar played a pivotal role during the first and second COVID waves by facilitating expeditious approval to the industry for producing critical suppliers, including medical oxygen. For his selfless dedication to the COVID causes, he was conferred the honor of COVID warrior by Sri Bhagat Singh Koshyari, the governor of Maharashtra. PESO as an organization has been striving to facilitate the ease of doing business and reducing the compliances burden. Sri B. Kumar sincerely thanks Secretary DPIIT, Sri Anurag Jain and additional Secretary Sri Rajiv Singh Thakur for the constant motivation and guidance given to his department for making it more citizen and customer oriented by encouraging them to develop digital tools and platforms for achieving the above objective. 
which are in alignment with the government's mission of minimum government and maximum governance. Bureau Report, NBC News.